There's two reasons you shouldn't eat meat. Right. One is even if you don't care about animals, there's no way we're going to feed the planet no. by eating meat. There's too many people. Because 97% of the world's soya is mm. fed to meat animals. It's not fed to people. Right, yeah. So it doesn't make any sense. No. But meat tastes better than soya. Yeah, but then it destroys the rainforest and also people are starving. I think people in Woolwich don't give a shit. I'm not saying that people in Woolwich don't care anymore about anyone else. But you get my analogy. The rainforest, isn't the rainforest supposed to be saved by the people that live near the rainforest instead of slashing and burning it all the time? Yeah, but they slash and burn it to raise cattle to export. To eat. You can't eat a rainforest, can you? No, but it's provided most of the world's medicine. It provides our oxygen. It disposes of carbon dioxide, it keeps the earth cool. Yeah. But um, well, we've got to eat. <laughs> yeah, but there's no, more, I mean, there's no, more no, sustainable no. ways of eating. You look good on... Well, I've been vegetarian since I was 11, so... Well, I couldn't see you doing any weightlifting. I walk my dogs 12 kilometres a day. Are they heavy dogs? Sorry. <laughs> 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 there you like animals. But Most of them would eat us. Yeah, but it's all, it's all propaganda, it? isn't it? Like, if you look well, back yeah, at what No, happened. the ones I've met, I don't like. <laughs> you don't like animals you've met? No, you cows, not really. No, all of them. Yeah, you probably haven't met sheep properly. I haven't met sheep How properly. How many sheep do you know? I went out well. three of them. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think the problem was in the Falklands? <laughs> no, um, no, I know sheep. But there's, but there's propaganda about animals, the way there's propaganda about slavery, about how we... What does the Bible say? I don't care what the Bible says, I don't believe in God. Oh, OK. So... What hope have you got there? Pardon? They don't. What hope do you have? They went out hope. to the jacuzzi. Hope. Um, I believe in... Do you think that's it, then? We're going to... That's it. Yeah. This is as good as it gets. Yeah. Oh. I want to ruin it. Yeah. yeah. Dad. No, but, you know, I, I had a mummy sheep take refugee in my fields with her two lambs years ago. So I cut off her tags and cut off the markings and kept her. And now when you go and see her in the field, she's still with her two lambs. And they love each other, you know. But every year those lambs are ripped away from her. Killed. And killed. I know. If you and see she babies, it's heartbreaking. The babies. You've never eaten another bacon. No, and I did a story babies. in the Mail on Sunday about abattoirs. So it's a production line. Yeah, understood. One question from me. Well, let's say tomorrow you get your way. I phone the Prime Minister. David, you've got to listen to this woman. Right, OK? <laughs> We're not going to eat any more meat. So all the farmers that raise meat and that, we've got to find new jobs. Do you know what our Hang farmers on, let cost me us? Let me finish, let me finish, let me finish. Oh. £38,000 a year each in yeah. subsidies. Yes, OK, that's fine, but that's not us, that's Europe. So that's another story. Yeah, but we but pay billions to Europe. Let me, let me get this question out. So we don't rear any more cattle or sheep. What happens to them? Or deer? They'll all be dead in three years. Yeah, there won't be any. But would you want to have a child and knew that you knew that child was going into a question. concentration camp? Question. They're better not alive. Answer that question. No, They're better not alive. But, but if, we, if we stop now, you've got your rights to that. We're not going to eat no more. Yeah. What do we do with all the animals? Well, I'm already doing it. I have a food business. There's thousands of them. Well, I have a food business and I've just retired 1,700 chickens. No, no, they we're talking gave... cows. Cows, great big oh, cows. Oh, yeah, Herds of them. What, yeah, what happens to them? Yeah, we've retired. We've retired Cows as well. well, what happens? There'd be no more cows, would there? Because they wouldn't no, have any more. We don't. They'd all die. No, they all die out. So they wouldn't have any cows on Earth. No. Isn't it bad to have some cows? No, not if they live a terrible life. No. Oh. Do you think horse breeders in Ireland should breed thousands of foals yeah. for racing? Yeah. And when they don't make the grade, they're sold for meat and they're exported live and sheep are exported for ritual yeah. slaughter. It's better they're not born. You wouldn't want your child born and then exported and then slaughtered in a ritual But they're fashion. humans. They're not beasts of burden. But they're not beasts of burden. They have rights. You see, I sort of do believe in the Bible a bit. No, boys. What? I'm just going to be like this. I can't hear you, Mom. <laughs>